When CCU President David DeCenzo removed David Bennett as the Chanticleers coach last week, the university's board of trustees was informed of the decision beforehand, but was not involved in making it. Friday, the board met for several hours, and when the closed door session ended, board members had little to say about Bennett or anything else. We have a policy that we do not discuss anything that happens in executive session, I'm sorry. But former CCU quarterback Tyler Thigpen held nothing back in his letter harshly criticizing the decision to remove Bennett as coach. Thigpen wrote, worthless excuses are being made to fire Coach Bennett. He said football game attendance had not dropped in recent years as DeCenzo had stated. Thigpen called Bennett's dismissal poorly conceived and unethically executed. He claimed Bennett and the program have been harangued by the CCU administration for the better part of the last two football seasons. Thigpen says he will not donate a single penny to this institution again, and he asked that the banner with his picture on it at Brook Stadium be removed. As of today, Coastal Carolina no longer has an NFL quarterback as a booster, fan, or alumnus, Thigpen wrote. Through a CCU spokesperson, DeCenzo said he hasn't received Thigpen's letter, hasn't read it, and so can't comment on it. I also asked for a comment from the chairman of the Board of Trustees. Did you see Tyler Thigpen's letter? No, I'm sorry, I have not.